Gundam streaming Gundam Online. Not quite late night. It's 10 p.m. It's Thursday. Uh, June. What's today? Where the fuck is my phone? Ninth. 2016. Thought it was the 10th already. Because time flies. Um, and, uh, what? Yesterday, uh, they buffed, they buffed some, uh, 380 cost suits. Uh, this half was buffed. Where, uh, our bow here has got a new weapon. It's, uh, it's got, like, these, like, I don't know. <laughs> Direct fire missile things that aren't missiles, but like beams, but are ballistic rounds. It's they basically forced a like a like a like a rifle like weapon on its missile pods because missiles were being useless, and uh, the bow was like in the range, needed to kill things, but <laughs> these missile things didn't help. We're gonna play around with it later. But the Zeta here, the Zeta, oh well, also the, the Bao here, he's got his shield buff to Zeta levels. No one had any idea why that uh, the Bao had this Gimp shield, whereas the Zeta had this awesome shield. But that at least leveled that playing field. But then they. They buffed the Zeta in a way that uh, made the Bao's buff. Seem like I don't know, more like a, like a patch, <laughs> like it was bugged or something. Um. So the Zeta, what can I do now? Uh, they made it so that he doesn't two-hand wield his hyper mega launcher, so that he can has it have his shield up. While using it. And then they also, he also got. Uh, a damage buff on his bazooka, which is this, I don't know, this Swiss Army knife that is the the, the mega beam launcher. It like launches all sorts of different beams. Like it's got this direct fiery death beam, and it's got like this bazooka beam, and it does lots of damage dealing things. Something that the bell wish it could do too, deal damage. But it deals the bazooka deals like eleven hundred points of damage. It's doesn't doesn't seem like it like it's I'm gonna say it's like breaking the uh, I don't know the uh, what was that what's that word like the rules set by the game like currently this we got an assault class that's got a bazooka that deals that deals 1100 points of damage like I don't know you, you figured a heavy would get something like that first. Because heavies, you know, <laughs> they're supposed to have bigger firepower than the assaults, where the assaults get speed, but I don't know. Zeta's like, oh, I don't need to follow the rules. I get 1100 points of damage on my bazooka. So he, he automatically has like, a rocket shooter on his bazooka. Then what else did it get? And it, it also carries an extra round. Mm. Oh, and also these two got, uh, like, their, like, Mozilla tops buffed or something, it deals more damage, so like, uh, the not dual firing one, uh, it's got 500 points more damage, which is like having a rocket shooter already on the weapon. Yeah, yeah, like, I don't know, Zeta got all kinds of stupid buffs, like, I don't know, whatever, I just, I try to not think about it, because thinking about it, just remind you that you're playing some kind of broken game. And, uh, I was playing earlier. Uh, like, way earlier today. Like, you know, in the afternoon. Uh. And there, there was, like, this, exp like, the, like, the population of Zetas exploded. There was just Zetas everywhere, just blasting the shit out of everything. Um. And, you know, with the Zetas and the Kyakushikis, like, the Zetas just 
providing this wall of explosive firepower, and then you'll get Chakshiki's, also, which also has... Well, he doesn't have this yet. Oh, I can't wait for the, the fucking Chakshiki to get one of these. Probably the first uh, 2,000 point dealing bazooka that we'll probably see in the game or something. Unless uh, the dev team's gonna keep up with their uh, their their theme of uh, what you call it, uh, bringing into uh, the game suits with these gigantic guns, you know, in the show, but like giving it really pathetic firepower, uh, like that. Uh, I don't know that, that, that what the, the the heavy doga, like it's got you know the the giant Bruno gun. It's got its uses, but I I thought it was like this giant like I don't know like a like a gauss cannon like weapon that just deals crap tons of damage. But no, it's, it deals like tiny bits of damage uh, separated into pieces. No, I don't know. Really haven't gotten around to building my silver one. Um. Anyway, so I'll go Shangri-La first. And I hate this. I hate this freaking wallpaper screen or whatever with the Cubelay trying to fight a Zeta. Cubelay never engages in melee combat with anything because it'll die before it can get that far. The GM twos here. I see a lot of tight shells using GM twos. It's like a better GM. Which you you would think is, you know, well, well no duh, I mean, it's a GM too, of course it'd be like a better GM, but no, no, this game. This game likes to, um, you know, release updated versions of suits with like worse stats or that's less functional. <laughs> so you never know until you like look at the stats and try out its weapons and find out that the the load is shit or something, there's just something ridiculously wrong with it. What is this? Hey, nice, I got a DX ticket. Cool. Right, and... So when I was playing earlier, before 4.30pm, uh, I swore, like, I wasn't jumping properly. Like, I would land, and, like, I wouldn't be able to lift off. And I thought, like, I don't know, I was, like, in, like, it's, I was in Eternal Landing Stun or something, or, like, I was, like, my my, the edge of my foot was like running against like like a like a like a tiny incline against a cliff face or something like that, and I wasn't taken off into the air. But apparently it was a bug. Like some uh, landing animations uh, made you not jump, made you uh, made it so that you can't you couldn't jump for a while or something. It's freaking stupid. So I spent like an hour ish playing a game where I wasn't able to jump properly. <sighs> Any... Any cool platoons I can join? How do I something? Oh, but he just got started a game. This guy's cool. He uses high guns, I think. Well, not today, but yeah, he's he's a he's a super high guy guy. <laughs> look, at the, look at the amount of base damage he dealt with this thing. Uh, yeah, and he's uh, he's got a custom high god. Oh, he's 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 the top high god user. Pretty pretty funny guy. Wait around. And I've been uh, like playing around with the Z the Zissa, the Zusa. It looks cool. I, I like how it looks like a like a like a power a dude in power armor. Although uh, because the game doesn't have the mono eye animations going. It just looks like it's got like this lazy eye. <laughs> it can't. It has to like turn to look at you straight. <laughs> um, I, I wish this game had like working mono eye animation. That'd be wicked. 
the uh, the arcade game, the uh, Senjo no Kizuna, had the uh, like when you're in the pod, right, with the joysticks, it the the uh, mobile suits had working eye animation, so like you can turn your guy looking right, and then the Zaku next to you is like looking at you with his mono eye. It just it just looked badass. I like I love the game except for you know it killing my wallet, so I, I don't play anymore. Uh, Right, so this is the new weapon. These, like this beam-like weapon, but missiles. But not missiles. But not beams. Uh, I tried to type F. I didn't like it. It, it fires two for one, so it's double the damage if both shots land. But type F, both, both, bleh, both shots won't land against Gundams or GMs. Maybe against a gun cannon, but those two, those two other suits are too thin. And uh, while on the move, your shots will like, I don't know, uh, like crisscross and miss and leave you sad. Because only one would hit, and only having one hit doesn't deal any damage. And then the Gundam proceeds to kill you while striking off your pathetic fake missile gun. So I've been playing around with this, and I and I use it like a like a broke ass beam rifle because the accuracy is nice, uh, and it's dealing about 300 points of damage per shot. So I like follow up after, like a down from the grenade launcher or something. And also uh, this type F because you only got one round, one shot. It, really prevents the bow from like being able to engage at close range which I don't like like when a, when a, when a Gundam is able to get into your space then there's really little you can do to protect yourself and I really don't like that I don't like Gundams being able to have his way with me especially on a 380 suit like it just makes me angry you know, whereas like others, like my 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 favorite Zakatus, he's just got like an infinite amount of options compared to to the bow at any range. If he's a threat at any range. That's why I like this thing. He isn't. He just can't deal damage. It makes you play like a pussy. I hate to set makes you do that. Let's play a game. Right, so the what the booster pod on this thing? It's got a smite small buff where it doesn't reduce your speed anymore, but it still tanks your boost recharge and uh, like something else. It doesn't make sense. I don't know why a booster makes you go slower. It makes you go slightly faster, but you're still going slower in the grand scheme of Zessa things because you're losing the boost recharge. And when you, when I say it's faster, it goes like like what, like 5 or 10 or something faster? So what's the speed now? 1061. Adding this. Not only tanks your balance. Yeah. 10, I think you gave me like 11 extra. It, it just cuts your boost recharge by like a quarter. That, that's significant. It's stupid. But it, it does raise your, what, uh, recall time? It's like, what do you think do? Like, that, 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 that makes me angry. This entire game is just anger in in gigabytes <laughs> on on your on your hard drive currently. Yeah. And I played to figure out suits here and there, but it, I don't know. I'm trying to make like a any kind of diligent effort toward it, just because when you sit and invest too much time of your day in this game after you get up you feel like you just wasted your day <laughs> so I try not to play this game as much you go yeah 10 faster yeah exactly Zier you go fucking 10 faster it's pathetic <sighs> we got 
Archons on the opposing side. Do we have an equal number of cons? I mean, yeah, I, I, I guess. We all should have just started playing the Federation to begin with so that we can laugh at Xeon <laughs> for all their misfortunes, but damn, it's like we're just giving up. It's like saying, well, then we'll just, we're playing the strong, we're just, we're just going to go and play the stronger side because we don't want to try. I'm not sure if this is what I wanted. Actually, I didn't. I didn't want the missiles on my Zissa. Oh well. Some kind of music. Some kind of music. We're probably going to be losing. <laughs> That's usually my, uh... That's my prediction for every game. Uh... That's playing, like, some kind of... Where... Losing kind of music. Can't find one. What about you? Oh, this is this is that freaking track that sounds like Resident Evil. <laughs> We'll change it in the way. You see the, the Tetra? The Tetra is... is annoying. Even playing a Xeon. Because Tetras like break the game. More so than how the Zeta broke the game by getting an 1100 damaged bazooka. Like, they don't have to play by... by rules that lots of other suits have to follow. This is Santa Claus. I can't see! Uh, Whoops. I didn't mean to bring it out. I can't play when the music is shit. This is important shit. I need to fix it. Here we go about this one. This is better. Right, so this. So you, you can use it like a like a like a beam rifle. And it scares Gundam sometimes. Okay. See. I like the way this one works more. Yeah. <sighs> Except when the hallway is filled with Gundams in America colors. All right. Well, so they they want my dough. We won't see it again for another ten minutes. But I like...
suits that go forward, not backwards. That's why, like, for me to use a suit, it has to have a very aggressive setup. I don't think so. Okay. <sighs> I killed by like a Chusa. Waiting for the dropship. That he's not. There he goes. Yeah, but they're all waiting for it. <laughs> Obviously. Oh. <laughs> the fuck? What the hell lit me on fire? Oh, really? Oh, does this? Oh, does this? It's got the fucking thing. Whoops. And it's pointless too because I don't even have weapons that use it. I forgot to take it off. It's currently serving no purpose right now. <laughs> because I've increased my recall. This thing's boost recharge is pathetic. Where'd it go? That's 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 the fucking names. It's not... Oh yeah, my my ten moves speed. Watch out. Another go, go, and just go. Dropping mice from up there. Oh, we got it. Go, 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 go. Nah. <laughs> Am I in cooldown for a whole minute? Gundam go. 
Yeah, behind the track. Ah! Did not mean to walk onto it. Watch behind you. Nah, I'm dead. Up, 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 yep. I'm sorry, Schneid. Are you still alive? No, not anymore. Got behind me. They're moving for X. Oh, I'm stuck on the fucking full armor garden. Being stuck on a fag is the worst. They're going for X. We need to collect what contains we can and hope that those guys are up there defending. I'm on a friggin' GM thingamabob, and this guy isn't fast enough to be able to... Ooh. Ouch. Let's try going around. Alright. I'll be for the blue destiny. Oh, wow. I thought those were bad guys. Hi, assholes. I, I super missed. You guys want to come out and shoot that guy? No, no, you got to some holes. Alright, let's see if I can get like a above position. Oh, they're coming in again. See again. Instantly died. No. I didn't feel very confident flying my bow in there. Look at that. See that? That's a that's a pansy on a on a camper running away. Oh! Get him, get him, get him. Okay, I'll, I'll get him for you. Shit! No! Since that, that can't hold ground, I just I just don't like them. Like like these expensive suits. I'm not good at playing keep away. Like playing keep away at close range, yes, but it's not. Oh, but there are guys still in there fighting, so we're going in. They're like super pulling back. Yeah. Oh, Okay, <laughs> whatever. What if I'm killing stuff? Did I 
guy. Think so. Oof. Silly with this suit with this gigantic booster pack on his back and, and it's moving so slow. Oh, that's a uh, friendly. We don't need to be here anymore, do we? Nope. So guess what? I'm gonna make use of its quick recall. Eleven eleven seconds isn't very quick. We need to defend north of four. They're probably trying to sneak in through this way. This freaking boost recharge. Okay, thanks for scaring the shit out of me. So this is Galbaldi. It's a Galbaldi. You don't really see these guys very often. The, the heavy type. Does, does this not even crouch when he goes to uh, spawn out? No, me. Oh, yeah, they had to move going. Yes, they did. Go with this Galbaldi. Let's get that. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Oh, it's totally missed. No, 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 Didn't do too bad on the uh, on the Zissa. What is what is this new guy doing? What is he trying to do? Get that! Uh, right, come on, I'm here. Dropping fire. There we go. Look at that. <laughs> I gonna continue forward. Yes, they are. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> oh, and we're in a minute of uh, limbo. Someone is liking our base. And there's nothing I can do about it. Because of the battle, and it's 10 minutes of cooldown. So I'm trying again. They're gonna fail. 
but, uh... See, when, if you stay pessimistic, when what you predict don't, don't happen, then you f feel happier about it. If you're optimistic, then when your hopes and dreams are crushed, you feel worse about it. <laughs> so, I say try to stay pessimistic, pessimistic all the time. That is just my, like, one rule I, I hold dear in my life. Or I stay true to oh there they go. Let's get on top of this. What? Where's that nuke? Oh fuck. Oh we we lost a nuke. Oh he just went. seconds to make one kill. No! No! <laughs> I think I locked onto the wrong guy. Oh, I have my rocket shooter. Silver print, uh... Yeah, again, I would have gotten it. Yep, I'm just gonna pretend that we're not ha we don't have an event today because. Um... That whole pessimistic rule. When you get your hopes up for these stupid uh, event tickets and you don't get any, it just leaves you upset. Alright, let's let's take off that dumb booster. I'll have done way better. If I had some kind of speed. M m not speed, alright, because technically this thing is giving me 10 speed. But, uh, mobility. <laughs> the pet term. Having 230 boost charge gives you way more of that mobility that I needed to be able to get in and out of cover. And uh, where's that other setup I had going? Yes. Well, the missiles... The missiles weren't doing too bad. That one instance where I staggered the gun to him and I followed up with some rugged rounds. If I just brought type S... Well, see, Type S is too heavy, so I'm gonna use it. 